Hey, this is Ty with Green Regimen. Welcome to Green Regimen's 30 day quarantine workout challenge. Today is day four. So today, you know what? Actually, before I get started with the first workout, I just wanna thank you for these videos that you're sending in. I love to see them. You're actually dragging your kids off the PlayStation and you're getting them involved. I love that. So keep sending those videos, keep sharing these videos. That's what this is all about. Make sure that after watching the video though, you do the workout because I don't want you just to scroll through Instagram, look at our videos and keep scrolling, giving your fingers a workout. After the video, I want you, you can even go to the website, download the workout plan, but I want you to do these exercises because after this 30 days is up, who knows how much longer this quarantine is gonna be going on for, but at some point we will all be free. And if you can't focus on a workout right now while you can't leave the house, then once we're free, who knows what you're gonna do. So. Just stay focused, keep it going. Thank you for watching. All right, so here's the first workout. Today we are gonna start off with 25 wide stance push-ups. So check this out. You know how to do a regular push-up. Keep in mind with each rep, you wanna keep your core nice and tight. So a regular push-up, we'd have our hands a little bit wider and shorter width apart. But for today's push-up, we are going to be extra wide and we wanna make sure that our tempo is nice and slow. Give our joints a break. Up. So it might even be a three count. One, two, three. Touch the ground. One, two, three. All right, so yes, I know a lot of people out there can't do the regular push-up on your toes. I got you covered, as always. Let's do it on our knees. And trust me, we're only gonna do 25, but because the tempo is so slow, we are gonna get that pump. That's why this workout's called Pandemic Pump. All right, so we're gonna do them on the knees and we're still gonna use the same tempo. Up, that's right, 25. One, two, three. One, two, three. There it is, 25 wide stance push-ups. You know what I'm about to say next, let's get it. All right, so for our next exercise, we're just gonna sit here and think. We're just gonna rest, no we're not. Next exercise, we're doing 25 tricep extensions. Now remember, it's not a speed here. We're in no race, we have plenty of time, we're quarantined, we can't go anywhere, so there's no rush. So it's all about tempo, pandemic pump. So now I know that this is a no equipment workout, but I figured everyone has a chair in their house, so you can just grab a chair, grab the edge of the chair, make sure it's sturdy so you don't fall, we don't want any catastrophes. Have your core nice and tight. And we're gonna come down slow on a three count. Three, extend the tricep, full extension. One, two, three. One, two, three. One more time. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now, you could also make it a little bit easier by bringing in your heels a bit and coming down and up. Now, if that is even too difficult, I have another way, because I told you Green Regimen always has you covered. I have another way on how to do these. Have your hands uh, not too far away from your hips for support. Now you wanna pick up your waist, keep your stomach nice and tight, and you wanna come down. Now your butt's gonna touch the ground pretty quickly, so you might wanna arch a little bit. Make sure you get that full extension. This would be the easiest way to do them, but you'll still get that nice pump, pandemic pump. Now we have an exercise that many of you might not have done before. You've done regular push-ups, now you've just done wide push-ups. Now we're gonna focus on the triceps and we're gonna do a close grip push-up. Check this out. So you wanna have your thumbs roughly six to eight inches apart. You're gonna come up, keep that stomach nice and tight. You're gonna come down, chest touch the hands and come up. Same tempo. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now, if you start to do it quickly, I want you to have my voice in your ear saying no. Slow it down, slow it down, because that's the point of this pandemic pump. It's all about just slow control movements because tomorrow we have a much crazier workout and we can get the joints going, but we wanna just keep everything nice and calm. There it is. Now it's time for 25 split squats. Now you're gonna alternate. So that's 25 with the left leg, 25 with the right leg. You wanna grab the chair again. We wanna stand in front of the chair, lift up our back foot. Now we wanna make sure we're sturdy. Now with this exercise, extreme caution with your form. So go slow, just like all of the exercises here in the pandemic pump workout, but focus, focus here, okay? 
So we want to make sure when we come down, our weight is going to be focused on our heel. Now, if you start to wobble, just go slower. If you need some stability, you can hold on to something because the point of this is just slow control movements, but get the exercise done. So 25. So we're gonna come down to about 90 degrees if you can and come up off the heel. Everything is coming off the heel. We're coming down on the heel. Make sure that your knee doesn't go over your toe, just like a regular squat. And we're gonna come up. When you do 25, if you can get to 25, if you can't get to 25, take a rest and then switch. Same thing on this side. Come down, then up. You can breathe out on the way up. Breathe in on the way down. Not a race. We have all the time in the world now because we can't go anywhere anyway, right? Time for some abs. Today we're going to do 25 leg lifts. You've probably done leg lifts before, but we're going to go over the form just in case. So we want to lay back. So if you don't have a strong core, what these leg lifts would do sometimes is put a little bit too much pressure on your lower back. So to avoid that, we're going to take our palms and we're going to put them on the floor, but underneath our lower back. And we're going to start the leg lift with our heels roughly six to eight inches off the ground. And we're gonna come up slowly. But we're gonna stop about midway. We're not gonna go all the way up here. So we're gonna keep that nice range, six inches off the ground. And we're gonna come up slow. We're not gonna go down slow and come up fast. Nope, not today. Now for the pandemic pump. Keep our legs somewhat straight, not, not overly straight, but just so we're nice and comfortable. And 25 reps. Now you might start shaking, but that's just how it works. It's how it is. It's okay though. You need to shake. You need to get those abdominals firing because that's how we burn that fat. We're gonna work these obliques, get these obliques nice and strong. So we're gonna take the same form as we did with our leg lifts, put our hands underneath our lower back. Although this time we're gonna have our legs straight, but we're gonna be midway off the ground and we're gonna cross over right to left. Two, two, three, three. I want you to keep that core tight. Four, four. Now, I don't want to see this because that's too fast and you're trying to rush through it. Pandemic pump, slow and controlled movements. So we're going to keep it going with the abs because we all want that six pack, don't we? So we're going to start on this, the ground here. And these are called ab roll ups. We're gonna take our palms, have them right next to our, the sides of our body. So when we roll up, we're in control. So we wanna take those knees. You don't have to touch the chest, but we just wanna come up with the knees and the chest at the very same time. 25. Now, if you really wanna get super athletic and fancy, you don't need the hands. And just make sure your back touches the ground. Slow and controlled. I don't want to see any jerkiness. We don't, we're not doing that here. Pandemic pump, slow and controlled. Last exercise. I mean, are you ready for this last one or do you want me to give you some more? Okay, last one, fine. So we're gonna lay back, have our knees bent. I want you to keep the stomach nice and tight, which means we're gonna go back to our other ab workout where we may believe that a chain was hanging from our chin to the ceiling. So we're gonna stay flexed the entire time. 25 reps. One, one, two, two. Now you see how slow and controlled I'm doing these? When we're tapping the ankle. 25 oblique ankle taps. Just like that. No need to rush. Yeah, you should definitely be feeling this burn. No question. Make sure you watch all of the videos prior to doing the exercises. I know a lot of people like to just look at the schedule and then they just go and do it. But no, we don't want that. We wanna make sure that you're watching the form, make sure that you're 100% careful and comfortable with doing all of these exercises. But that's how it works. Make sure that you share these videos with your friends, with your family. Make sure you do them though. That's the whole point. If I'm taking the time to make these videos, I really do want you to do them because before you know it, It'll be 30 days. And I trust me, if you actually do these workouts every day, you will see results. Make sure you're drinking your elite protein. 
See you for day five.